Hi guys, welcome to my channel. This is your 10 minute back burn workout. We are going to do five exercises, spend a minute on each exercise and repeat those once again. So a total of 10 minutes. You will need a pair of dumbbells for this workout. I'm going to be using two kg dumbbells, which is about five pounds. You should use dumbbells that are not too heavy, but not too light as well. And I'm gonna put on the timer and then we'll get started. So for the first move, we're gonna need the dumbbells. So let's get to them. And we're just going to bend forward, knees bent, and back should be straight, not arching down, back straight. And we're going to just row. Squeeze at the top, squeeze your upper back. Keep your abs tucked in, your shoulders down, and feel this on your upper back. Go as slow as you like, there's no need to rush. Actually, the slower you go, the more burn you'll feel. If two kgs is too light for you, up the weights. This should feel challenging, but not too challenging that you don't do it. Keep on going. So this is great for the upper back. A few more seconds here, and then we'll get into the next exercise. Keep going. Feel this in your upper back. I'm feeling it. I hope you are too. Few more seconds here. There we go. Okay. Next up, we have a dumbbell exercise. So in this position, we're going to bend forward, straighten our arms and back should be straight, not bent like this. Straight and open and close. Again, abs tucked in and this is a great exercise for your upper back slow and controlled don't bend your elbows too much just a slight bend is enough keep going slow and controlled there is no rush this is your workout go at your own pace make sure your abs are tucked in shoulders are pushed down chest is open back is straight knees are bent bending the knees is a great way to support yourself Keep going, we're almost there. On to the next move. Keep going, there we go. All right, next up is on the mat. So we're going to come on down to the mat and on all fours, we're gonna be holding the dumbbells and we're just gonna pull and down, pull and down. And if you want something a little more challenging, go ahead and lift up your knees like this and continue with the rows. I'm going to do it on my knees today. Again, abs tucked in. Feel it in the upper back. Keep going. Keep going. It's a non-stop back burn. <laughs> this will help you get those toned muscles in your back. Keep going. It'll help you become stronger. And of course, toned back muscles look good as well. So that's a bonus. All right, next up, we don't need the tumble to so push them aside and come on down onto the mat and we're going to do glute bridges. So in this position, just lift up and come on down. Squeeze at the top, squeeze your glutes and come on down. So every time you lift up, squeeze the glutes, yes. And this is great for the lower back. This is great for the glutes. And often to support the lower back, we need strong glutes. So this is a great movement for that. And your hamstrings are getting involved as well. You feel this in the back of your legs as well. Slow and controlled. Keep going. You're almost there. All right. Are you feeling this? Are you feeling this in your back, in your glutes? I am. Keep breathing, exhale when you take your glutes up and there we go. On to the fifth exercise and again on all fours position and we're going to lift our right arm and left leg together. There we go. And now we're going to change legs. There we go. So we're just going to do this. This is a great exercise for the back. 
for the core you feel your glutes and hamstrings activate as well and this will test your balance it looks easy but it's not very easy slow and controlled everything doesn't have to be fast you know sometimes the slower movements are more difficult keep going we're almost there halfway through the workout we're almost there stay with me i know this is 10 minutes non-stop back work but it's worth it right you're worth it so keep going all right back to exercise number one and we're going to pick up the dumbbells get into position and back straight don't bend it like this straight and just pull squeeze at the top straighten it out pull squeeze at the top straighten it out keep going go at your own pace make sure your abs are tucked in your shoulders are down chest is open knees are slightly bent and back is straight feel this in your upper back when you come up squeeze squeeze as if there's a pencil in between your back and you're trying to hold it when you come up keep going keep going we're almost there don't give up now stay with me i know the back is burning and there we go rest it out for a moment again we're going to bend forward back straight arms in front open and close open and close open and close and the same thing applies here abs tucked in chest is open shoulders are down back is straight knees are bent and your back is burning as well <laughs> keep going and you can have a slight bend to the elbows but not too much of a bend if you're bending your arms too much drop the weight right use a lighter weight if you have to do it like this right if you have to do it like this no keep it slightly straight just a slight bend in the elbows are you feeling your back work now i am keep going almost there keep breathing don't forget to breathe you know often when i'm working out i forget to breathe <laughs> i hold my breath and that's not good on to the all fours position and we're just going to row right so let's begin and even now the abs should be tucked in your core should be tight your chest should be open and your back should be burning keep going keep going we just have i believe two more minutes after this and again if you want more of a challenge lift up your knees and get into a plank position and do plank rows i'm going to stay here today and that's my level today <laughs> keep going keep going two more moves this is the last tumble move we have we're almost there 10 minutes go by really fast actually if you think about it 10 minutes just flies by if you're working out and you're enjoying it there we go last two minutes and on to the back think of your glutes think of your lower back and lift it up and squeeze come on back down and repeat keep going put the intention in the muscle right think about the muscle that you're working focus your energy on that that's a great way to make the muscle you know work a little bit more if you focus and with focus you squeeze and maintain correct form keep going we have about less than 2 minutes to go and then we'll be done with the workout we're almost there so stay with me don't give up squeeze your glutes lift them up squeeze them and there we go on to the last one all fours right hand left leg right lift change hands change legs and take a moment now to make sure your abs are in make sure you're maintaining correct form make sure that everything is working 
correctly. Make sure you're balancing yourself. If you need to slow down this movement to get more balanced, go ahead, slow it down. We're almost there. This is the last move, last exercise, and then we'll be done with the back burn. Keep going, keep going. Almost there. Almost there. And there, we're done. So that was our 10 minute back burn workout. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon if you like this video. So I will see you in my next video now. Bye.